man, it's so early, but it's time to get up, because I'm shooting today, five more minutes, five more, mm, so early. You make me feel so getting up early except for when it's for a call time because I just get so excited that I don't care what time it is. What have we here? Some yogurt with some blackberries and pistachios. Look pretty good me. All right, I'm headed to go shoot this uh, true TV pilot. It's just a little tiny part that I'm doing with the guys that I made Fuck Mary Kill the Game Show with. Uh, should be really cool. I'm excited. And 10 minutes later, I'm done. Just kidding. I was only there for like 20 minutes though. Uh, we did like four takes and that's it. Done and done. I love working with those guys. They're so cool. They're laid back, but they're focused and they just really appreciate what I do, which is show up like a professional and get the job done. You know, I always know my lines. I always know the story that I'm telling and that's about it and i show up with a ton of wardrobe options i can't show up with too few i just i'm like oh what if i wish i had that thing you know so anyway i wish i could go back to bed but i am working a double today because it is cinco de mayo so let the festivities begin it's time go work So the guy that I was scheduled to work with is in the hospital, so they hired somebody from an outside company, which means I gotta play trainer today, you know, show them how to do the job, basically lead the whole demo, give all the product information, because this guy doesn't know any of the product information. Just gonna be a little extra work for me. I really hope that guy from our company's okay. Uh, I've never met him before. That sucks. Anyway, here goes first shift of Cinco de Mayo. For this? Are we in this or Yeah. This? Hey. Where's the camera? <laughs> there? There? <laughs> it's a video. Oh, it's a video. <laughs> so here we are. I love this place. I do too. Right? It's so great. <laughs> I've gone back and forth to and from my car like five times. It's back and forth. So I heard about this thing. It's called the drunk trolley and it goes to all the bars in West Hollywood and transports the drunk people. Doing the Lord's work. No, that is pretty cool though. Especially today on Cinco de Mayo. So I'm finally done with my shifts. Originally, I was supposed to do a third one right now, but it got canceled, which I am totally okay with. I'm, you know, less tired than I was before, but like very ready to be done working, so that's nice. Uh, but I'm starving. I can't believe nobody fed me at either of these places. <laughs> Guess I got spoiled. Uh, yeah, my job. I get hooked up all the time with free food, and uh, I didn't today because it was so busy. So I'm going to get something to eat. <laughs> 
like immediately. Do you ever wonder how people end up at the bar or restaurant that they're at? Sure, sometimes it's a spot they like, but I'm like, what Google search words did they use to end up there, you know? Or they're meeting a friend. I don't know, just, I think about it sometimes. There's someone I can't wait to see. Who is it? It's only 10.30 and I am so tired. <sighs> I might just go to bed. It's really early to be going to bed on Cinco de Mayo, but it's been a long day. I don't know, maybe not quite yet, but I'm going to bed real soon for this shop. I just killed a spider with my shoe but it was up there. Can you see? I have a shoe mark now. Oh, you can't zoom on this side, but there's no boot mark on my <laughs> ceiling right by the, you know, on my wall right by the ceiling. I'm so tired. Now I can sleep soundly knowing that the spider is dead. I would have tried to help save it, but it looked really gnarly and if I don't act quick, they usually disappear, so we're just gonna go to bed now. Cook! Beach! Beach! She cannot be disturbed. The princess is sleeping. You make me feel so 